Okay, so let's solve this problem. So find the standard equation of an ellipse with the given coordinates. So we have this the center, the vertex, and the length of the minor axis. So first, we need to graph this ellipse. Then from the given coordinate of the center, x is negative 3. And in a plane, this one is positive x negative x, positive y, and negative y. So for x negative 3, so negative 1, negative 2, then negative 3. Then for y, that's positive 4. So positive 1, positive 2, positive 3, and positive 4. Then you connect. And this is now the point of the center then for this coordinate of the vertex x is negative 3 so x negative 3 and y negative 6 so negative 1 negative 2 negative 3 negative 4 negative 5 then negative 6 then you connect so this is now the point of the vertex then observe that in a graph the vertex is in vertical position so since the vertex is in vertical position so therefore this ellipse is a vertical ellipse and formula for the standard equation of a vertical ellipse, that's x squared over b squared plus y squared over the a squared. Then to write the standard equation, we need to find the values for h, k, the a squared, and the b squared. Then to find the value for h and k, since the center of an ellipse, that's h and k. So therefore, h is negative 3 and k, that's positive 4. Then for a, since we can solve for a from center to vertex, so therefore, from the center to vertex, so we're going to use the counting method. And in counting, you start counting on the next point. So from this point, you start counting on the next point. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So therefore, a is equal to 10. And for a squared, that's 10 to the power 2. Then to solve for b, since b, that's the minor axis divided by 2, then we have this given minor axis that's equal to 12. So to solve for b, that's 12, then over 2. So b is equal to 6. Then for b squared, that's 6, then to the power 2. Then since we have now these four values, so we can write now the standard equation of this ellipse using this formula. So we have x minus h, and h is negative 3, then to the power 2, over b squared and b squared, that's 6 squared, then plus y minus k, and k is 4, then to the power 2, over a squared and a is 10 squared, then equals 1. Then to simplify, so we have x, this one double negative, that's positive, so plus 3, then to the power 2, over 6 squared, that's 36, then plus 
y minus 4 then to the power 2 over 10 squared. That's 100 then equals 1. So this is now the standard equation of this ellipse.